massive pile of hay um, dropped off for mulch from a, from a local farmer. Um, so really great because it's spoiled hay and his stock don't want to eat it. So well, we'll use it in the garden and it provides the most amazing amount of seed and stuff for our chickens. So we've piled it in here. So they're out here um, working their way through at the moment and uh, <laughs> loving all the seed. And uh, well, I've got a double up project I'm going to try and do here. So um, this is a bag full of uh, oak sawdust and, um, and chipping that I did uh, maybe three months ago and I put in the last of an end of a spawn of Strophaeria rugoso annulatum, is it? Uh, you know, anyway, uh, and uh, I, I think it's taken, as you can see there's lovely white threads here in this side of it, but unfortunately it's also infected with um, some blue mould, I think that's called trick, right? So what I'm going to do is to um, take the this and kind of go, well, some of it seems to be working, so there's fingers crossed there's lots of live Strophaeria there, and I'm going to tip it out here in the middle of this hay, and I've dug like a, a nest for it that's weighed down. I'll fill that up again, um, I'll tip, sorry, tip all the wood chip in there, fill it all up again, and then, um, then put the hose on it, and hopefully um, it will start running through this um, straw and hay that you can see up here fair amount of carbon there so eh, fingers crossed but hey look it looks like it's got contamination and it looks like it's taking over and I'd really really like Strophaeria growing on the property so anyway best of luck cheers